So a little update on the truck. I haven't really been shooting much footage lately because I've been having an issue that's been driving me absolutely crazy. It's the oil pressure sender, which is right there. So when the distributor plugged in right there, when it's not plugged in, I get a positive reading, you know, 35, 45 pounds of oil pressure. But when I plug it in, it goes to a negative reading. I'll show that video now. So to demonstrate, I'm gonna go ahead and disconnect now. So, disconnected. I go into the digital dash. Try and start. And you'll see right there, under oil pressure, <laughs> 43 pounds. Bolts are good. Fuel is reading 16, 15, slowly going down. However, if I plug in. Alright, so I went ahead and plugged it in. I'm going to replicate what I just did. noticed the fuel went to only 5 instead of 15 and the oil pressure went to negative 11. So we got something feeding back incorrectly somewhere. However, I've, I've called Holly, oh my goodness, six, seven times. I've spent five, six, possibly even seven hours on the phone trying to diagnose everything from grounding issues to how I have it hooked up to um, <clears throat> I got too many things on the same switch uh, switching point which they're not um, we, we went through this entire system piece by piece uh, I put on um, some other asking for help um, other media forums asking for help and everyone says it's grounding well it's not grounding at this point I have hmm, alternator grounded to frame, motor grounded to frame, battery grounded to frame, engine grounded to body, battery grounded to body, um, battery grounded to core support, frame grounded to body on the underneath. I, I got 13 or 14 different grounding points on this vehicle it's it's not a grounding issue um the the last time i called holly they finally said okay um you've been calling in enough times we spent enough time on the phone with you go ahead and pack it up send it back to us we're going to do some diagnosis in house for it. and while you're at it send in your digital dash so i'm going to go ahead and take this off and package it up with the digital dash and send it back to Holly. They already sent me the shipping label. So it's going to be out for three weeks to a month before I can get this back and back installed. And hopefully there's just an error somewhere inside the Holly itself.
16 minutes and I have the whole in, the whole fuel injection completely removed. Now I got to pull out the digital dash. 